This is our high field MRI, uh, three Tesla MRI. Uh, so this is replacement of the former MRI we had, which was a 1.5 Tesla. So double the field strength, also newer technology with much faster uh, acquisition speed. So we can probably reduce by half uh, the time it took us for imaging before. And the main applications here are gonna be small animal neurology, uh, brain and spine imaging are definitely what we do the most with this machine, but also some other application in oncology and in small animal orthopedic. And also the big change for us is that the previous MRI we had was not accessible to horses, uh, but in this room, the machine is positioned facing the last door where the horses can come. And what's on the left here is technically the back of the machine. So the small animal patient will come on the patient couch on the right side of the machine but we can bring horses here on an MRI compatible table. You can see all the signs of a strong magnetic field, a lot of restriction with what can come in this room, but we can bring horses from the back and we can image a uh, horse's brain, a uh, horse's distal limb. So these are things we were not able to do uh, before and that we can do here with like high imaging quality. We still have a low field standing MRI, which allows to image the horse's distal limb without having to drop the horse, so there's still some advantages for that if we don't want to anesthetize the horse. But here, if we anesthetize the horse, we can image faster with better image quality, and we can also do the brain, which is something we were not able to do before.